at Walmart. Kevin uh, got him some new shirts. He loves uh, these, like, um, are they Henley type shirts? Yeah. Is that what? Yeah, they're, uh, yeah, Henley. And he usually gets these at Kohl's. And at Kohl's, I'm thinking they're about $20 a piece. At Walmart, they were $9.98. They, um, he got the, like, the cream, the green, the light blue, and the gray. However, they did have red, black, and they had a dark blue. Mm -hmm. Did they have a dark gray? They had a dark gray, or, yeah, they had a, they had a darker tan, brown. Oh, that's right. They had, like, a rust color that yeah. you tried on. So, um, Kevin tried one of these on right over his regular T-shirt right there. And uh, so, these are going to fit him nicely. But for 10 bucks, these are nice shirts. So, he got... And I have T-shirts with the George brand. They're really soft. They're nice. Yeah. He bought this George brand before we went on vacation for some shirts to take with us on vacation. And they're really comfortable. Uh, so, then we bought uh, two packages of Johnsonville beef broth. Didn't have the turkey. Yeah, they were out of turkey. We bought a, another box of this Lance Toasty Crackers. They're the peanut butter. I absolutely love these. These are new in our area. These are Mama's Biscuits, and these are the s'mores. And I looked up their Instagram page. They're going to have like six more varieties. So we'll just have to wait and see what we get in our area. And then we bought four of the A&W uh, Zero Sugar Root Beers. At Kroger, we bought some of their corn chips. These are called corn chips cups. And the reason we bought these is because these are new. These are corn chips, but they're buffalo style dip. So we figured we would just compare them because we love Fritos. And so we'll try those. We bought a loaf of bread and some uh, creamer for our coffee. And then if you're interested in these, Kevin is gonna be reviewing these on his Lunchtime Review channel. They're both new for Kroger. It's an English muffin ham, egg, and cheese, an English muffin light turkey sausage, egg whites, and cheese. In Meyer, we bought these Lily's Toaster Grills. What is so funny about these is they say new. But if you look back on my Instagram page back in, I think in June, we found these in Hawaii. And in Hawaii, they said new as well. But they had one, I posted a picture of it. It was like jalapeno and something else. We're just now getting them here. But it's funny, Hawaii got them first. So, uh, Kevin's going to be reviewing these on his Lunchtime Review channel. We have the grilled ham and cheese the grilled American cheese, and the grilled cheeseburger sandwich. Also at Meyer, I bought this Reese's Pieces, mini pieces cookie kit, and the S'mores Betty Crocker uh, cookie cups s'mores. Those are both Betty Crocker. And then at Target, I bought the new Cliff Bars. This is a white chocolate cranberry. I bought the Good and Gather Pumpkin Pie Date and Nut Bars and the Hot Cocoa Date and Nut Bars. I bought the Quest Cookies, their Frosted Cookies and the Chocolate Cake and in the Birthday Cake. And then I bought the new Alani Witches Brew. This is an energy drink. And then Kevin's going to be reviewing this. This is a Campbell's Double Noodle. It's new. Uh, he'll be reviewing that on his Lunchtime Review channel. And then Hope has been wanting me to try these for a long time. Our Target was always sold out of them. So I finally was able to get them today. They're the Starburst Gummies. They're Sour Berries. She says they're awesome. I can't wait to try them. At Home Goods, I found two mugs that I, I desperately needed some mugs because I don't have enough. Uh, these are um, uh, designed in England, Harvest Green Studio. And this one says Sweater Weather and it's little hedgehogs which are adorable. And then on the inside, it has leaves and a hedgehog. He's wearing little mittens. And then I bought this one that says pumpkin spice. And you can see it better on that side. And then it has the leaves and it has a pumpkin on the inside. And then I bought um, some baking supplies, some spatulas, that's for Halloween. And then this is a nightmare before Christmas. We did go in Marshalls. We didn't buy anything in Marshalls, but Marshalls had a um, Sanderson sister Hocus Pocus set. But these were really cute. And then I bought this peanut set. I thought that was cute too. And it just says Autumn Fun. And then at Walmart, uh, we bought the Stepped Puffs Big Bites. This is S'mores, birthday cake, and cookies and cream. Uh, we bought the uh, new Kellogg's Corn Flakes Cinnamon. 
Somebody asked me a long time ago to try the Great Value Macarons. I had not seen them until today, so we're gonna review those. We bought some sweetener for our coffee. And then at World Market, these were on sale. These are the Kios Crinkle Cut Atlantic Sea Salt and Balsamic Vinegar. I love these and they were on sale, so I went ahead and bought those just to enjoy. We've already reviewed them. And then I bought some of these Loker. These are uh, wafer cookies. This has tiramisu, hazelnut, and gingerbread. Uh, we also bought these Gnaw candy bars. This is a raspberry crisp and dark chocolate, almond and toffee sea salt and milk chocolate, crunchy peanut butter and milk chocolate, and milk chocolate, just milk chocolate. Uh, we bought the Virgils. This is a vanilla cream. And the reason we bought the Virgils vanilla cream at World Market is because we had just been to Tuesday morning and found some Virgils to review. So, in Tuesday morning, we had found the just the regular root beer, the uh, zero sugar root beer. This one is the black cherry. And this one is the orange cream. I can tell you right now, they were much cheaper. They were $4.79 at Tuesday morning. They were like $7.99 at World Market, which is ridiculous. Um, also at Tuesday morning, we're gonna be, uh, we found these we're gonna be trying. These are Boots beverages, and they're actually made in Texas. So we bought the Orange Dreamsicle, the Red Hot Picture Show Red Hot Soda, the Strawberries and Cream, and the uh, sarsaparilla. And then I bought these two mixes. I love Southern Living Magazine, love their recipes. And so uh, we're gonna be making the pound cake with glaze and it's actually orange. Uh, that's what sold me on it, it's cause it's orange. And this is a uh, mini pecan pie muffin mix.